Okay everyone, it's H2O Reactor. I'm back again, folks. And from our previous video, uh, you saw me build this flashback arrestor uh, slash torch. So what we're going to do is have it tested uh, using our H tower reactor over here. Um, you have to make sure all the time that safety is important. So we have a, um, a blow up cap here with a uh, plastic membrane. Uh, blow off plastic membrane just in case the flame got through the flashback arrestor and it goes into our bubbler and instead of the bubbler exploding we have a rupture mem membrane here and also for our generator it's just in case the the, um, the bubbler fails we still have uh, our last line of defense and we have also a plastic uh, rupture membrane here just in case the flame got through the bubbler and got inside our generator remember false hydrogen is very explosive so alright so let's turn this thing on and we got some bubbles so we just have to wait for a few seconds just to let the uh, the old air go out of this uh, container go out of this generator and out of this bubbler because they're not yet explosive they're not yet combustible so I'm just gonna give you how it looks okay you know what happened? My power supply just quits because it only um, this thing is only rated uh, for 10 amps and 55 amps for charging, and it won't uh, it won't run for too long. Look at that! It's crazy, right? Okay, my power supply again stops. <laughs> It is auto shut off by the way. If I'm pulling too much current, it will shut off itself. But anyway, it's back again. But anyway, what we're gonna do is try this out. Oh yeah, and see that? Now Yep, did you see that? The flashback? It stops right here. So let's wait for the power supply to come on again in a few seconds then we're gonna light this up okay it's back now see the flame see the flashback Our power supply just stop again because we're pulling too much current. When you pull, hey, look at this. See the flashback? I guess, folks, you get the idea. The flame. Um, the reason why the flame is going through in here is because there's not enough pressure to push it out. Um, when the power supply turns itself off, the flame will start to go in and it will stop right here. Alright. Wait again. All right. I'm not sure if you saw that flashback, the flame going in here and stopping right here. Well, I guess that's good enough for a demonstration. Uh, stick around, there's more stuff. Thanks for watching.